Hello, this is Bob the Polearm Enthusiast here, in the land of Calradia. Um, ooh, I'm being attacked. Who's this guy? I don't know. Hmm. Well, anyway, I have been sent here by Paramecium914 to... I'll figure out what he wants in a minute. But yeah, so I'm Bob the Polearm Enthusiast, like I said, and I've been sent here by Paramecium914 to the land of Calradia to do a mountain blade, uh, let's play. Woohoo. I guess. I don't know. Alright, so, I'm gonna talk to this guy. So, um, basically this guy's a merchant and someone stole his brother. You have to go rescue him, but first you have to... Uh, get an army together. So, anyway, I have traveled to the land of the Road Oaks here in Jakala, and I guess the first thing I should do is probably go out and make some money. Yeah, I, I know. Okay. So, I'm gonna go ahead and attack these out losers here. Out for a here. stroll, are we? Oh, yes, we are out for a stroll. So, like I said, I'm a polearm enthusiast, but uh, if you look in my uh, inventory box here, uh, I have no polearms. So this is this is a major problem. Um, so we're gonna have to get one of those pretty soon. And uh, so anyway. Um, this land of Calradia is under the spell of a certain individual from the mythical land of YouTube known as uh, Vex. Yes, uh, he has cast a spell in the land so that makes you, uh, well, it basically makes you level up faster. So I guess it's, it's a good spell. Vex is a mythical wizard who deals with the magic of computers. I have no idea what a computer is, but that's what he does. Is, but he has cast Calradia under the spell of this mod, and uh, I guess it's to my benefit, so I'm not going to worry about it too much. But um, I'm sure if you were to visit his realm, aka channel, you could probably figure out how to download this mod for yourself. It's a pretty decent mod. Not that I know what a mod is, of course. I am a mod. dead. Ooh. So now I get to loot them. Cool. Alright, I already have food. Um, let's see. I guess I can put this hat on. That'll kind of help with my armors a bit. Let's see, this is 14, 11. They have no boots for me. Ugh, these don't even have an armor value. Uh, let's see. 24. Yeah, this is a little bit better, though. Um, hmm. Lots 
of weapons, lots of useless stuff. I mean, it's not useless. I mean, hatchets are pretty fun to use. And Anyway, let's so beat them up. I don't think I took any prisoners. Um, okay, well, let's go sell my goods. Hmm. Game acts like I've never played it before. Oh, what, what, what game? I'm sorry. The clubs are bludgeoning weapons, so I might actually hold on to that. And, uh... Ooh. I do want to make money right now, so I'm gonna keep my sword. And, uh, the club, it will only wound guys. Well, it won't only wound guys, but it will usually just wound guys. Let's see, what do, what do we have here? Um, a glaive. I like glaives. Glaives are pull arms. See, pull arm. Uh, heavy jarreds, balanced jarreds. Those are all good, but uh, I would like it. Ooh, I can buy this one. Uh, balanced scythe. Well, I am a pull arm enthusiast without a pull arm, and I can afford the scythe. So, it's not my favorite, but I will buy it nevertheless. Um, I guess I should equip it. Sweet, I have a pull arm now. Now, my favorite are the bulges. I don't know why, I just kind of like bulges. Not necessarily just in Calrati, but anywhere. So, um, I'll go pay a visit to these looters. What's this Tell then, eh? What. So there are 15 of them, but... <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, that. That is wicked. That is wicked. I think I have to use this, this battle. Battle of Adventures, you know, the 14. I can do that. Ooh, my life. My health is pretty low, though. So I probably shouldn't get in too close to them. But, I mean, these guys don't even have shirts, so I shouldn't pose too much of a problem. Just gonna ride some closer around and shoot them with my crossbow. Ooh! That was an answer to level 2. They have a lot more rocks, but maybe I can get them to run out of ammunition so they're not really a threat. Because while I'm riding, like around circles around them, like, uh, they can't really seem to hit me. Uh, actually, if I go behind this hill, then I won't be able to hit me either. Right, shoot them. <laughs> Ooh, my position shooting crossbow is increased. Because, um,
several of these guys in that room, so... Man, that site is just wicked looking, like... I might, I might keep it, actually. Like, I don't know how good it is, but... That guy, shot the shoulder. Still chucking stones at me. I don't know, maybe they're out. Fifty-two. I am really improving my crossbow scale. Not that it matters too much though, because I am a pull arm enthusiast. I use pull arms. There shall be no survivors. Oh, oh shoot. to a bit of a rocky start, but that's okay. That is okay. And I still have my horse, so... And I'm at mostly full health, so I'm gonna get those looters back. Just gonna make sure I have everything. Yes, I do. It's kind of weird that I have all my weapons after they've had me prisoner, but I guess I might have stolen them back. I don't know. But I'm at mostly full health now, so this should be a mop-up, because there's only four of them. Actually, I want to use this. Yeah. Okay, I took some damage there. Now, as you can see, this isn't the greatest cavalry weapon. But I expect on um on foot this would be a uh, pretty nice. This looks like I'm old. It's got a great Hmm. Taking a lot of damage, but that's kinda because I'm a uh, Fighting them hand to hand. Alright, I should probably go back to the crossbow. It appears they have him unlocked an achievement. I'm not quite sure what an achievement is, but. Because I am Bob the Bull Arm Enthusiast. Just a simple. I took that guy prisoner. I'm going to capture him. And I'm going to take all their stuff. Let's see. This stuff all looks worse than what I have. Catch it. Okay. So I think one thing has been made clear to me. Uh, ooh, 28. I need an army, so five. That's that's exactly how many I needed. I'm gonna go back to there. Boop. There we go. Go to the castle. Uh, actually, no, I don't want to go to the castle. I want to go to the tavern. 
Merchant. Cleffy. Ooh, Cleffy. Hey. And one thing about this spell that Vex has cast on this land is that um, you can sell prisoners directly to the innkeeper. I only got a few coins, but I'm going to go ahead and recruit her. Let's see. She was a servant. Uh... She's able to buy her stuff out of bondage. Cool. Um, so, and then she stole someone's amulet. So, ooh, she's she's vicious. So, I'm gonna hire her. Here's her monies, and I'm going to go ahead and talk to the merchant because I have enough people now. I shall hunt for bandits. Uh, go to the marketplace. Oh, actually, I need to equip my uh, new party member. Uh, equipment. Let's see. Uh, 14. It's better than anything I have. I don't have any hats at the moment. She's gonna have a shield and a. Um... Ooh, she can she can wield the sword. So plus six. That's plus eight. But that also gives her some leg armor, so I guess I'll leave her in the dress for now. Um, yeah, I guess that's it for her skills. She doesn't need to be upgraded yet. Oh, but you know what? I uh, I can upgrade myself. So I have very low intelligence right now. I'm not very smart. So I'm going to upgrade that. And then... Ooh, I can get more inventory management. Yes. Um, pull arm proficiency, because I am a pull arm enthusiast. Uh, I guess crossbows. Hmm. Um, prisoner management. I don't really need much more of that at the moment. Trade. Um, max out and power strike. Um, horse archery. I'll get some horse archery done. Alright, so I need to go fight these bandits. You'll die. Alright, and here's my little ragtag army. Let's go, go ahead and charge in. Basically, he told us where we can find what we're looking for. Hat. I have plenty of inventory management, but uh, I guess I'll go ahead and equip my Quethy here. My Quethy. Heh <laughs> She's mine. Um, let's see. You get a hat. And, um, plus six, that's plus 24. Here, wear this. Oop. Or I could just have her wear that. Meh. Alright. Wait, did you level up? Oop. Uh, wrong button. What's a button? I don't know. Okay, so I guess we gotta go over here. 
I should probably camp. Oh, I don't have any prisoners. Derp. Just gonna camp here and uh, kind of recover some health. see. Alright, that should be good. Well, eh. Eh. I, I'll just go ahead and sell some stuff real quick. Ooh, wait. I sold my food. Hmm. Oh well. I'll just buy it back. did not mean to sell my food. Alright, so I just lost money there. Shoot. And let's see. I guess I'll just go ahead and take out the kidnapper's hideout. Why not? I'll be somewhat... Actually, let's see. Inventory... Might be able to recruit some volunteers. Yeah. Now I have no money. But I have lots of these guys. Ooh, and some of them are ready to upgrade. So, um, I'll get some spearmen. Oh, wait, I can't because I don't have money. All right, I'm going to go ahead and attack. Attack the hideout. Alright. And I have my big scythe here. I'll be able to use it on foot like it's supposed to be used. Eventually, when I get enough guys to be comfortable, I'm gonna fight uh, several of my battles on foot. When I have enough guys and enough armor to protect myself. Ah! She already has throwing knives, so I don't know if she even needs stones. Let's see. Get rid of that dagger. Uh, she's not strong enough to hold a falchion, I guess. I'll give her a hatchet instead. Hmm. Maybe some rocks. Yeah, I'll... Yeah, yeah I'll give her a Okay, no prisoners. So, we're just going to camp here for some time. Recover health. And, um, Paramecium914 has instructed me to do something called a microorganism shoutout. Now, I have no idea what a microorganism is. It sounds like something evil, but, um, 
Uh, okay, so let's see. Its taxonomy is in the phy it's in the phylum Ciliophora, so it's a ciliate. Not they know what that is. Class Ludostomate, order Vestibuliferida, family Balantididae. I don't know how to pronounce this. Um, and apparently it's parasitic. It causes Balantidiasis, only known. It's the only known ciliate that is pathogenic to humans and it can be caught from contaminated water well great great little tiny demons that live in water i don't know why anyone would want to know about that kind of thing but yeah hmm so yeah that is the microorganism shout out for the day i suppose i was instructed to say that i have no idea what any of that means because i am bob the polearm enthusiast and I am here to sell things that I took from these bandits. And um, I guess that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching um, from the mythical realm of YouTube. Um, not that I know where that is. Um, I'm, I have been told to tell you all to comment and uh, subscribe. Not that I know what that means, but... Uh, Thank you for watching. See you all next time.